This is a Queensland narrating service recording of A Better Public Transport Network for Ipswich, Springfield and Surrounds. Made on behalf of Translink. Your narrator is Kay Stevenson in October 2013. A Better Public Transport Network for Ipswich, Springfield and Surrounds. Your handy guide to your improved public transport network. Effective December 2013. Bus Queensland. Great state, great opportunity. Translink. Queensland Government. Contents. Introducing your improved public transport network. Getting to know your improved network. New Springfield Rail Line. Improved bus timetables with more direct routes for train connections. More trips for popular bus routes. Improved local services to get you where you want to go. Summary of changes. An overview of your improved network. Frequently asked questions. A detailed guide to your improved network. Route 463, Goodness Station to Forest Lake Village. Route 500, Riverlink Shopping Centre to Goodness Station. Route 502, Bundamba to Riverlink Shopping Centre via Blackstone. Route 503, Bundamba to Riverlink Shopping Centre via Eastern Heights. Route 506, Riverlink Shopping Centre to Leichhardt, one mile. Route 509, Yamanto to Riverlink Shopping Centre. Route 512, Brassel to Riverlink Shopping Centre. Route 514, Teverley to Beval Fair. Route 515, Brassel to Yamanto Willowbank. Route 522, Orion Springfield Central to Goodness Shops via Springfield Central Station and Goodness Station. Route 524, Goodness Station to Red Bank Plains. Route 525, Collingwood Park Loop. Route 526, Orion Springfield Central to Red Bank via Springfield Central Station. Route 529, Tugulawa to Ipswich. Route 534, Browns Plains to Orion Springfield Central via Springfield Central Station. Route 539, Helidon to Rosewood Rail Bus. FlexiLink Services Getting around Ipswich, Springfield and Surrounds. How to use your network. Tickets and fares. Introducing your improved public transport network. From Monday the 2nd of December, Translink will be making some changes to the Ipswich, Springfield and Surrounds public transport network in line with the opening of the new Springfield rail line. We know we've made a few changes to the network over the last couple of years. During that time, we've worked with you and our operators to see what's working and what's not. We're making changes to give you an improved public transport network that better supports the needs of your community and local travel patterns, as well as catering for the new Springfield rail line. Getting to know your improved network. There are plenty of exciting changes and improvements to the network. Some of the highlights include two new train stations with a bus interchange at Springfield Central Station. Improved bus timetables with more direct routes for train connections. More trips for popular bus routes. Improved local services to get you where you want to go. New Springfield Rail Line from Monday the 2nd of December, Springfield residents can travel directly into Brisbane CBD by train for the first time as Queensland Rail and Translink unveil the new Springfield Rail extension. The extension, which includes 9.5 kilometres of dual track and two new stations at Springfield and Springfield Central, 
is being delivered as part of the $475 million Richlands to Springfield Rail Extension Project. This project is an example of Queensland Rail and TransLink's commitment to providing public transport solutions for southeast Queensland's growing population. Springfield Line Timetable The Springfield Line Timetable will extend current Richland services to both Springfield and Springfield Central stations, providing consistent services stopping all stations between Springfield Central and the Brisbane CBD, services every 6 to 12 minutes in the morning peak and every 12 minutes in the afternoon peak, 30-minute departures during Monday to Friday off-peak and on Saturdays, services every hour from 7 a.m. and every half hour from approximately 10 a.m. to 10.30 p.m. each Sunday. Springfield Line services will be represented by a light blue colour on the train network map, train timetables and passenger information displays. The new timetable will be available at translink.com.au and at key city network train stations from November 2013. Accessing the stations by bus. The following bus routes will service the new bus interchange at Springfield Central Station. 522 Orion Springfield Central to Goodner Shops via Springfield Central Station and Goodner Station. 526 Orion Springfield Central to Red Bank via Springfield Central Station. 534 Browns Plains to Orion Springfield Central via Springfield Central Station. Springfield Station is also situated a short walk from Route 522 bus stop on Woodcrest Way. Accessing the stations by car. Springfield Station is located on the western side of the Centenary Highway and can be accessed from Neb Smith Drive. Springfield Central Station is located opposite Orion Springfield Central and is accessible via two new underpasses beneath the Centenary Highway. 200 car spaces will be available at Springfield Station and 100 at Springfield Central Station. An additional 400 car spaces are currently being constructed on Greenbank Arterial Road for Springfield Central customers and should be completed in early 2014. Improved bus timetables with more direct routes for train connections. We are improving connections between buses and trains. Better timetables with more direct bus routes will make your train connection more reliable and your journey even easier. We're also adding additional trips during the week for key commuter services. Connecting to train services along the Ipswich line or the new Springfield line. You will be able to take advantage of the following improvements we've made to the 500, 522, 526 and 534. 12 extra weekday trips on the 500 and Sunday services for the first time, 19 trips. Services every 30 minutes during the week and hourly on weekends on the 522. More options to connect to train services with the 526 extended to Springfield Central Station. Access to the rail line with the 534 extended to Springfield Central Station. More trips for popular bus routes. You told us you wanted to see more frequent bus services where you travel regularly. We've listened. There'll be additional trips for well patronised services like the 500, 506 and 522. We'll get you to the train, uni or work sooner. More trips also means more travel options between places like Leichhardt, Willowbank, Bouval, Bundamba, Red Bank, Goodna, Springfield and the Ipswich CBD. 
We're making changes to routes 506 and 515 and creating a single, easy-to-use timetable with improved frequency during the day for the 506, servicing both Leichhardt and One Mile. A single, easy-to-use timetable with an extended 515 running weekdays every 15 minutes from Brassel to UQ Ipswich, then every 30 minutes from Brassel to Umanto and every hour to Willowbank. Improved local services to get you where you want to go. There'll be improved local services to get you where you want to go, whether it's to the shops, to work or to other key destinations around your local community. We have fine-tuned routes making sure they better match your travel needs. For instance, you'll notice that we have extended the 514 to Beval Fair Shopping Centre, expanded the 522 to include Springfield Lakes, providing local access to the new Springfield Rail Line. Summary of Changes Type of Change No route alignment changes no changes to the streets that the bus travels along, but there may be minor timetable adjustments. Check your timetable. Routes 463, 502, 503, 509, 524, 525, 529, 539. Route with new services. 500 Sunday services introduced. Merged route with realignment. Refer to route maps. 506 merged with 516 will be called 506. 522 merged with 530 and 535 will be called 522. Merged route with no realignment. Refer to route maps. 515 merged with 508 will be called 515. Route extension. Refer to route maps. 514, 526, 534. Route realignment. Refer to route maps. 512 realigned to include key destinations from removed 513. Route removal. 513 removed due to low passenger numbers. Key destinations included in 512. 535 removed due to local train access with the new Springfield rail line. Springfield Lakes residents can now catch Route 522. An overview of your improved network. Train lines. Ipswich-Rosewood line. Springfield line. Bus routes. 463. Goodness Station to Forest Lake Village 500 Riverlink Shopping Centre to Goodness Station 502 Bundamba to Riverlink Shopping Centre via Blackstone 503 Bundamba to Riverlink Shopping Centre via Eastern Heights 506 Riverlink Shopping Centre to Leichhardt 1 Mile 509 Yamanto to Riverlink Shopping Centre 512, Brassel to Riverlink Shopping Centre. 514, Tivoli to Beval Fair. 515, Brassel to Yamanto, Willowbank. 522, Orion Springfield Central to Goodness Shops via Springfield Central Station and Goodness Station. 524, Goodness Station to Red Bank Plains. 525, Collingwood Park Loop. 526, Orion Springfield Central to Red Bank via Springfield Central Station. 529, to Goolawa to Ipswich. 534, Browns Plains to Orion Springfield Central via Springfield Central Station. Frequently Asked Questions We understand you might have a few questions about your improved bus network, so we've listed some frequently asked questions below. If you have a different question or would like to find out more, please visit 
translink.com.au or call 131230 anytime. How did we arrive at this improved network? On the 24th of July 2012, the Minister for Transport and Main Roads announced a review of the South East Queensland SEQ bus network to improve service reliability, affordability and frequency. The review aimed to remove service duplication, manage infrastructure capacity, get more people on public transport by simplifying the network, get better connectivity between services and modes, redirect resources to routes where there is overcrowding. Since then, we've analysed travel data for every bus route in SEQ, worked with our delivery partners to understand what is happening on the ground and sought your feedback over three stages of community feedback. The first stage was undertaken from the 10th to the 23rd of September 2012. The second stage ran from the 3rd to the 16th of December 2012 and the third stage from the 11th of March to the 6th of April 2013. Opportunities for the community to contribute involved a page on the TransLink website, various online surveys with regard to specific service change proposals, customer liaison officers on the network encouraging people to provide feedback online or by contacting TransLink, flyers, signage and media releases. Approximately 20,000 responses were received over the three stages. What you told us. Some of the key themes you raised about your current bus network in Ipswich, Springfield and Surrounds included the need to improve local services to key community and activity centres, the need for better connections between buses and trains. As a result, We've taken your feedback on board with our analysis of the current network to deliver an improved public transport network. We thank you for your suggestions, feedback and ideas, all of which have helped to shape your network. Why have we designed the network this way? When we plan a bus network, we take into account a lot of things, including population, community travel needs, opportunities for network connectivity, bus stop placement, accessibility, traffic conditions and budget, to name a few. We take all of these elements into consideration and within the known constraints, we try to find the best possible solution for our customers. In this particular instance, we were driven to design a network that met as many of the community's needs as possible while delivering Queensland Government priorities. The improved network responds to both community feedback and existing network issues to provide a sustainable bus network that will support new infrastructure and the growing transport needs of the community. When can I get a copy of my new timetable? New bus and train timetables will be available in November at various locations, including key city network train stations major shopping centres and local libraries. You can also grab a copy by visiting the TransLink website at translink.com.au. Will school buses be changing? No, school buses will not change. School runs will continue to operate as per their normal routes and will continue to stop where they have always stopped. Information on school services can be accessed online at www.busqld.com.au. Will there be changes to bus stops? Yes. As part of the improved network, there will be changes to some bus stops, including some removals, relocations and installation of new stops. Bus stop notices will be placed at affected stops and we will be contacting directly affected residents about any works that will be undertaken in their 